Well, here we are, we're at Trainer Lady's lockup. I've got a feeling there's probably more here than I expected. Well, I'm on the way to hopefully do another deal with Trainer Lady. Now, I know I said last time that that was the last lot from Trainer Lady, but it appears there's still a small storage unit to have a look at. So, I'm gonna meet John Luke there, and maybe Charlotte, I'm not sure, but we're going to meet there and hopefully we'll get another haul of items, trainers, clothing, that kind of stuff. Um, I'm fully expect that this will be the last lot. Just in case you're not aware who Trainer Lady is, and this is the first video that you've watched on this topic, Trainer Lady is a lady that me and John Luke, a fellow YouTuber reseller, met at a boot sale. And uh, she's become a really good private contact for buying some trainers. It's a personal collection, trainers and clothing that's been collected and hoarded a little bit over many years. And um, we've slowly been buying it all off her. And we're off to do another deal. This probably will be the last one, I think. I've just got to find the place. I think it's here. I'm going to go in here. self-storage oh I think that's it so we are here from Torquay we can't be Chris we've got Louise um, it's the last of her collection, so we've got shoes, trainers, jackets again, so we're going to have a look through. We're on Chris's channel as well over here. You want to show the people? That's just how John Luke talks about it, it's not the same channel. <laughs> oh, you better read it that one, aren't you? That's baby blue fleece. Yeah, city blue. I think I, I think I have one of them, actually. Yeah. Yeah, I think I've got one of them. Nice, aren't they? Yeah. City blue, like Champions League blues, you know what I mean? Um, right, put that one over there. We've got three similars here, because you've got a North Face, that's a North Face. You've yeah. got a knife there. Yeah, 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 so what, whatever. Is that a hat tag? Yeah. So another one we can do. Um, that's, that. Just check it. that's a. What are these night trousers? Night again. I think they're These are cool. They're pretty like. Pretty nice then. So I'll, I'll, put, I'll put them to one side. I like those. Okay, well, I've got I've got those two, you've got to take some off. Yeah, yeah, take some off, yeah. See what's there. These high street, these ones, M&S. That North Face one's nice. Can we stack them up, see how many we've got? Yeah, yeah. They sell quite well, though. That's all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want me to put, um, stuff into brand palace for you, Josh? Uh, no, no, you will. I'll be right. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to buy that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, similar. Just watch that box. They're all going to be similar, aren't they? Yeah. Um, yeah, just, if you're not letting them put them to the side for a minute, do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, because it's not, it's not about quantity today, is it? No, no, it's just kind of... Because we've built up a nice bit now, haven't we? Yeah, nice. We've got powered plants as well. Yeah. 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 Boxes are a little bit, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. If you want the burger sauce, do you want to do a couple each? Yeah, yeah. What are those ones? Sandals, slip-ons. Yeah, if you want me to just take them too. Yeah. Paul Smiths. You have to do a little bit more research into you know, each one, but they're like uh, robes. Kind of suede robes. Alice Grenson. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Carl Lagerfeld. They were about nearly three hundred pounds. Yeah. Yeah. They look like Alexander McQueen's a little bit, don't they? Yeah, they do look like. Alexander oh, they are so cool. Cool on the side. Uh, two clocks each over here. Whatever, yeah. yeah. Both got a desert pair each and then both got a similar bottom to as well. Okay. They're wallabies. 
Timberland. There's silly. Oh, really weird looking Weird looking things. But I love weird looking things though. Yeah. That's, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, but again, <laughs> feeling makes sure they're alright. Yeah, they, they look alright. Yeah, they look alright. Shoes. Both decks, she's yeah, cool. Both decks. So I'll put one on each glass. Yeah, go for it. Levi's kids. Kids slash women's. Oh, they're nice. River Island, Reebok. Oh, there's another pair of rugs here. I'll, sort of, sort of, I'll, I'll just... Um... I'll buy a pair of rugs if it's even then. Both got equal amounts. It's fine. Gotta do one each on the Kirks. Yeah, they're both very similar. Very similar. Yeah, they're both similar again. Okay. Okay. I'll be able to do it to the winter. And then do it. And then do it, yeah. 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 It's not like Especially with, with that one. Yeah. That, that would be patchwork. It's, it's nice. nice. It's nice. I, 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 I've got one for these. No, that's one. This one? Yeah. What are they like? The slip on quads, kind of? Yeah, the boss ones. Well, I'm not fussed. If you can take two, I'll take two. Yeah. If you want the two well, big ones, I'm not bothered. Nike flat, yeah. Well, what are they both Nike flat? What are they in the name? Nike flat as well. I'll have one of them, one of them. Okay. Just because yeah. they're different. Different, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's fair. Stack each. Yeah. You're not too asked about what's what. So I like the brown ones then. They'll be fine. You want to swap them out, shall we? Yeah, there you go then. Yeah, just do one for it. There's like a few boots and a few shoes, so. Yeah. Whatever works. As long as there's a mixture. Yeah, right. Well, if you want to count through them, you can't just see how many. I'm really not. No, no. At the end of the day, yeah, the rugs are worth like 100 quid plus. Yeah. Probably going to want to go for these because these are going to be more money. So I'd probably go about 100 on these. Okay. That's what I'm saying, they're quite high end. Um, the cool smooth foot ones are that. 100 a piece or 100 for the four? 100 for that one. Yeah. 100 for the Grensons? Yeah. Because they're like, they were about 400 pounds. Yeah. Let's like, like, just do it. Just have a look at what. Just... Uh, I've never heard of them, but. So Usually stuff you've never heard of, so yeah, stuff that's um, really expensive. Yeah, to be fair, that's what I found with a lot of the trainers. Some of them I haven't heard of that have been worth it. Yeah. Ooh. Probably about 30 on the Ralph Lauren trainers. So. Right, this is it. That's the end. That's my pile done. We've, we've cleared Lorna out. Thank you, Lorna. I appreciate that's it. Right. Thanks for having us again. That's all right. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. 8.30 I owe you. Yeah. I am officially skinned. Right, thank you both very much. Appreciate right, it. You're Cheers. You are. All Listen, right, I'll probably right. see you again, so good luck with the move. Okay, All right. right, enjoy your time back with your family and everything. And like that, we are empty. We've bought loads between us. So I might show you a few pieces in a minute, see what we've got. Well, we're back from the storage unit and a big thank you to Lorna and Sean. Um, these deals are fantastic. Thank you so much. And hopefully it's helped you guys out as well. Certainly helped us. Um, and I'm going to go through everything. It's all here. In the end, I paid... What did I pay? In the end, I paid £850. She got another 20 quid out of me with some more stuff here. Um, so, yeah, I'll go through it all. I'll try and do it as quick as I can because I know that if you're not interested, you're not interested. But if you might be interested in getting some good deals off me, then please stay tuned and uh, see what we picked up. Remember, footwear wise, most of it is size women's five and a half to six and a half with some slight variations, possibly. And most of the clothing is roughly 18 to 20 ish size. Um, so yeah, that's what we're working with. Here we go, right, I've gone handheld on this bit. So we've got some white stuff. This is like a uh, tank jumper. 
a size 20, uh, not much else to say about that really. And what else have we got here? We've got another, is this white stuff as well? Yeah, white stuff. It's like a cardigan, size XL. This is a M&S collection fleece top. It's a shame it's summer now because these would be flying out. Uh, that's a UK size 22. I think, I think she only charged me £5 for that. Um, yeah, there you go. Say hello to Chris. Hello. Uh, let's have a look here. This is M&S as well. This is like a thin sort of... Looks a bit like Barber, but it's M&S. Thin jacket, size 20. Again, I think I think it was £5 uh, as part of the deal. And we got a cuddly toy. What is it anyway? What well, it's just be worth a load of money. Nature Planet. There you go. Cookie might like it. Um, we've got a Ralph Lauren. Now, I think this is used. A Ralph Lauren jumper brown um, XL. Another Ralph Lauren, this time it's a, is it a full zip? No, it's a quarter zip. Top 2XL. Quite nice, that one. This is all going to fall. I can feel it falling. Uh, what else we got here in regards clothing? We've got a Gantt jumper. This time it is blue. And it's an XL. Um... Now we're getting on to some of the bigger stuff. This is a size XL North Face fleece. I've had a few of these fleeces off Trainer Lady. And yeah, I've got a few listed and a few to list. Uh, this is quite nice. Uh, this is a uh, Napa Pidge, Pidgery. I mean, it's a, it's a high-end brand. It's a good brand. I think John Luke got a jacket with one of these branded. Um, this is a 2XL. And still new in bag, as is pretty much everything. If you've watched these videos before, Trainer Lady has gone through a pretty long period of collecting and probably hoarding um, brand new clothing and trainers. And... To be honest with you today, I don't know if you ca if either of us captured it on camera, but she was pretty relieved um, that we were able to buy another lot of stuff from her. Uh, but also, at the same time, didn't want to get rid of everything, which is understandable. Um, she's still got a lot of trainers that she's kept and some really high-end, did you see the Canada Goose jacket and some other stuff? I'm not ready to part with those yet, which is absolutely fine. Um, what else have we got here? This, I think, is a Timberland scarf. Oh, it's a shame it's not winter. I'm not wishing winter upon us, because I love the summer, but a lot of this is winter clothing. Uh, a Peruna um, ladies' coat, size 22. That's nice. I sold a Peruna the other day uh, from Trainer Lady. Sold it on eBay. That's a nicer coat. So I'm happy with that. I think she charged me ten pound for that. Uh, North Face. Uh, oh, that's just where it's been on the on the floor in the storage unit. North Face coat. That is a size large. Uh, what is this one? This is a Barber, I think. Barber Wilderness Collection, UK eighteen. Very nice. I don't think it's got its tags, but I might be wrong. I'll have to have a closer look. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's got its tags, but still very nice. I sold both barbers that I bought previously. Um, we've got some Ugg gloves. More winter wear. Um, I think these were like five quid. Ugg gloves. Um, I'll come to the trainers in a bit. Oh, nearly got cookie then. Nearly got you cooks. This is a double XL Nike coat. Or oh, it's a fleece jacket, I think. Oversized fit. I'm sorry I can't quite see it. Yeah, this is a pretty nice, um, I think what you call them, hybrid. That's better. It's a hybrid um, jacket. Look at the neck on it there. 
Uh, it is a size size double XL women's, but it's, it's a nice jacket. I also picked up this bike helmet. Now this helmet, I believe she bought it to go with an electric bike that she has. So I've not heard of the brand, um, but I think I paid 10 for it. I think there's around 38, 39, 40 pairs of shoes and trainers here. We've got uh, two, four, six, eight pairs of Uggs. We've got some Timberlands Air Campers, Birkenstocks. We've got some interesting Nikes, uh, Reese, load of Clarks, and then some sort of random other stuff. The Uggs are all size women's six, UK six. I can show you briefly what we've got here. Is that one? Now, not ideal time of year for Uggs or boots and stuff, but for the price we were paying for these, which is what, I don't know, 15, 20 pound a pair, you can't not get them. All genuine. Everything that we've had from Trainer Lady, by the way, 100% genuine. All past authentications. I've done authentications with the Check Check app, I've done authentications with eBay. Everything genuine. You know, some of these ones interesting, kind of like not the same as the other ones. Probably got a name. And these ones have got the kind of lenticular side there. Don't forget, if there's anything that you may be interested in, please drop me a line on Facebook or Instagram and happy to do you a good deal. Um, as I've done with loads of people, by the way, loads of people. Thank you. Um, we've got these Clark's Union Jacks. No box with these, uh, but they are a size, uh, I think they're a UK six desert boots. Um, we've got some Timberlands here. <clears throat> interesting sort of shape you know John Luke like the look of these as well uh, what size were these coming in at I'm not 100% uh, 38 and a half which is probably uh, 5 and a half UK 6 as, as per usual UK 6 um, campers the first pair of trainers that I actually sold that I bought from Trainer Lady were actually campers, so happy to get another pair of campers. They are a six as well. Some North North Face mules. Um, what size are these? UK six. I'm um, not sure what these are. Uh, hey, dude. UK six. Very very lightweight. I mean, nothing in it at all. Um, these are Reese, and what size are these? UK 6, so far everything's 6. Very nice shoes, 165. Come with a bag and everything in there. Um, some crew clothing, UK 6, yellow. Uh, I forget what you call them now, boat, boat shoes, that's it. Boat shoes. Uh, up here we've got what brand are these? These are Sorel waterproof boots. Um, and they are, guess what? UK6. Now these are nice. These are really nice looking. Kurt Geiger. Look at those. Coming from Selfridges, these. They are very nice indeed. Not sure what the value is on these, but I'm sure I will find out in due course. And they are a UK 6. Um, some Reebok uh, sandals, I think you would call them. I actually listed a pair of these earlier this morning before I went out. Um, they are, these are unisex actually, but these are UK 6, unisex, USA 7. And these Birkenstocks. And they're a UK five and a half. You see, it is worth looking. Five and a half UK. All right, we've got some more Birkenstocks. These ones, uh, like clog type, sandily slippery things. Uh, they're a UK five and a half. 
These Birkenstocks, these are more like trainers. Um, they are a UK five and a half. Now these are nice, these Nikes, Nike Air Force Ones. Like mid tops. Let's have a quick look what they are. Uh, Women's Air Force One Sculpt, white and coconut milk, UK6. Some Clarks here. Uh, these are like old school. They Don't they look a bit like, you know, the original sort of style of Clarks? Just maybe that bit there. Anyway, that's what you expect of Clarks, isn't it? Uh, Desert Run, UK6. Now, these are really interesting. Nike Offline 2. UK size 6. But look, they are sliders or sandals, whatever. Really nice quality. But look, they've got these extra pieces. Like extra soles. So, oh, actually, no, they're not extra soles. They, they just slide in. So you piece them together for some reason. Let me know what you think about these. So basically, sliders, and you have to put them together yourself. <laughs> Maybe they're saving money on the um, assembly line. Uh, look at these funky Clarks. Wowzers. Desert boots. Uh, they are a UK size 6, but look at them. I can't imagine for one minute that they're going to be difficult to sell. You know why? Ugly sells. Um, look at these Clarks as well. These are like padded, kind of weird looking things. Wallaby boots, UK 6. Um, we've got some Levi's pumps. They're nice looking things. I think this is actually a kid's size. Yes, it is, but probably fits women the same size. UK size 6, but it's down as Levi's kids. Um, what else have we got? This is a Cole Han. Cole Han, UK size 6. Don't know this brand. Very lightweight, like nothing in it. What have we got here? This one is River Island, I think. River Island Dun Duncan Isoth, UK size 6 boots. A little bit like Ugg looking. Look a bit like Uggs, but obviously River Island. And these are Scarpa, like walking boots, hiking boots. Sorry, the light's not great, great down here. Scarpa, and they are a oh, six and a half on the Scarpas. And the last lot, we've got a pair of Reeboks. These are kind of old, retro style, aren't they? Like 90s retro style Reeboks. Um, they are, oh, I can't see the size. Six, uh, five and a half. There are five and a half. We've got some Clarks here. They're a UK six. And um, we've got some more Clarks. These are Wallaby boots. Got a few of these now. Different styles, of course. And some Clarks. UK size six Craft Cup. And these are Kin by John Lewis size six sandals. These should go well. Summer's come in. People want the sandals. And these are Grenson. Grenson. And apparently Lorna said, or trainer lady, said that these were handmade. I need to look these up because I'm not sure what they are. Looks like they have been worn. A little bit of wear on the heel. So those I might have to go as second hand or pre-owned. Pre-loved. Well, that is it. That's everything. Thanks for sticking with it this long. Big shout out to Trainer Lady and Sean. And also shout out to John Luke and Charlotte. Thanks for joining us on all these deals. And um, I think that's probably the end of the Trainer Lady deals. But never say never. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button. And if you're interested in anything for yourself, drop us a line. Thanks very much for watching, really appreciate it. If you wanna catch up on another one of my videos, you can try one like this or one like this. They're both good ones, uh, give it a go. Or you can subscribe by pressing this button here.
There you go. See you later.